Well, John Ramshaw, it's uh, the last session of training before the season starts on Saturday against Bradford Park Avenue. Um, we've had a good pre-season, as Paul Cox has said um, previously. Um, what are you hoping from the last night in training and your thoughts about the game against uh, Bradford Park Avenue on Saturday? We need to get off to a good start. Oh, yeah, you always need to get off to a good start. Um, tonight, I think we'll probably just go through some set pieces. We'll do a little bit of shape with the boys. It'll be quite a light session. Um, they've worked extremely hard, as you know, throughout the summer. Um, and tonight, we just want to make sure that we don't pick up any injuries, any knocks um, at such a late stage ahead of the game on Saturday. And, uh, you know, I think everybody's really excited. Uh, I, this is the most excited I've been for a long time about the start of a season. I don't know whether it's because the last two were curtailed early but um, you know I'm really excited about the start of this season and looking forward to Saturday immensely. Yeah I bet you are Ben Marvin said that um, he's um, watched um, Bradford Park Avenue uh, what are your thoughts about it we've done well against him in the last couple of seasons. Yeah we have um, I think in fact it was uh, it was our first game in charge wasn't it when the, when the gaffer and I came here yeah and uh, we won won there and then uh, we beat them last season as well which was which was nice so yeah we've always done well against them and and historically we our sides have always done well against them as well so yeah, looking forward to it. We've had them watch. Ben's been there himself. We've seen a couple of um, couple of uh, video. We've seen some footage of the games against Scarborough, etc. Um, and uh, so, you know, we'll be prepared for it. Paul will be prepared for it. What's pleased you most about pre-season? It's been quite a long one, really. You can say from about October last year, really, I suppose. But uh, what's pleased you so far about pre-season so far? I think just the attitude and the application of the boys in general, you know, they've approached it very, very professionally. There's, there's been a good spirit about the camp. Um, the boys are bonding well together, uh, getting on. There's a, they're a close-knit group. Uh, and just, the, like I say, the effort, the hard work that they've put in has been immense. And, uh, you know, I, I, I think just for that alone, they deserve a, a, they deserve a successful start of the season. It's a very young team with a little bit of experience, but um, the league in general seems to be quite a, a young league, doesn't it, of players? Yeah, I think it's I think it's getting younger. Um, you know, we've we've lost quite a bit of experience during the summer, as you know, um, and replaced it with younger players who we hopefully will will take the club forward and we'll all move forward together, uh, which would be which would be nice. You know, if we, you know we're looking at longevity, um, and if we can keep the same squad together for a, a number of seasons, I think that that increases our chances of uh, of success. We've uh, made a number of uh, signings this week that have been put out on the official website and various uh, social media channels. Is, is that the end of it or do you see, foresee a few more players in the next week or so? Well, we're still in talks with one or two um, players and, and you know, we're, we're, they're sort of n balancing off sort of offers from other clubs against the offer we've made. And, um, and, and I think, you know, there'll be more coming in without a doubt. I think it's a very strong squad, if I'm going to that, we've got at the moment. You know, the gaffer and I were just talking on the drive down here about what a, what a lovely headache it is for Saturday that we've got such a strong squad of players to choose from. Um, but... You're never content if there's if good players become available. You know you, you've got to make a move for them because if you don't, somebody else will. Okay, John, thank you much for your time. Let's hope it's a, a great start on Saturday and a good night of training tonight. Let's hope so. Thanks, Paul.